to this now. Impala Platinum has announced a yearly financial loss due to impairments exceeding 2 billion rand. The company recorded a basic loss of 17.3 billion rand or 1,929 cents per share for the fiscal year ending in June, a sharp decline from the previous year's basic earnings of 4.9 billion rand and 577 cents per share. No dividends were distributed. Additionally, headline earnings of 2.4 billion rand or 269 cents per share plummeted by 87% and 88% respectively. Revenue dropped by 19% to 86.4 billion rand, while the cost of sales decreased by 4% to 80.9 billion rand. Investment research analyst Zimel Mbanja provides insights into the recent financial performance. I can't say much was unexpected from this result by Impala Platinum. I think market participants are very much aware of the current state of PGA markets, um, as well as you know the previous disclosures by Impala management, as well as guidance, pretty much set the tone and set the picture of what we expect. Headline earnings per share declined around 87%. Revenue declined around 19%. Um, you know, this is despite improved production and improved sales, as well as improved cost measures or cost containment measures. But the, deep, the, the depressed pricing of platinum uh, group metals was enough to offset all of these benefits. Um, now, fundamentally looking forward, there aren't that many signs that the PGA market is going to see a green shoot uh, as such. It is expected that a, a halt or a widespread halt in investments in PGM and PGM-related uh, projects uh, going forward is expected for the foreseeable future.